So this here is the replica of the 1920 Indian Scout motorcycle Burt Munro Special. And today we're doing the Spates Brewery Tour here in Dunedin City. This is the Spates Old Old Dark. I had to read that off there. <laughs> Remember what I was trying. Wow, so much history. Hey there, we're Matt and Nat, a couple of awesome newlyweds traveling the South Island of New Zealand for two weeks on our honeymoon adventure in our sixth birth motorhome camper van. We know you're jealous, so don't hold it against us. We finally got ourselves a camper van. If this is your first time to our channel, what the hell have you been doing? Hit that subscribe button, mash up that bell, and leave us a comment because we'd actually love to hear from you. In today's episode, we're doing a road trip right from Invercargill through to Dunedin. We check out the world's fastest Indian and do an historic beer tasting at Spates Brewery. It's going to be wicked awesome. Check it out. Stick along for the ride. Booyah! Good morning from Invercargill or Invercargill as it's commonly known. We're packing up the camper today and we're going to be doing some filming around Invercargill. And we'll guide Natalie out. Which um, motorbike would you like to drive? Um, that one, but I like that because it's got purple on <laughs> This is Burt Munro's motorbike trailer. Oh, yeah. This is the one used in the movie The World's Fastest Indian with Sam Anthony Hopkins. Wow. What's really cool about this place is it's all free to come and see these amazing cars and The World's Fastest Indian. Which we're going to go see right now. Through here. Oh my god. So this here is the replica of the 1920 Indian Scout motorcycle Burt Munro Special and you can, they're actually allowed you to sit inside. This is so cool. Wow. Yeah, I'm not trying to get into this thing. How's that feel? It feels pretty damn tight. Here's what we've all come for. Burt Munro's original 1920 Indian Scout 600cc side valve bought out up to 1000cc. So he did this all himself. Cool. And this beast here clocked up, I believe, at 100, it was 180, 182 miles per hour on the Bonneville Salt Flats. Can you imagine being in this? and going 322 kilometers. An hour. No. And this here is the replica from the 2005 movie, The World's Fastest Indian. One of five built. One of five built. You can see in there. This is incredible. So that place that we just went into is the E. Hayes store in Invercargill and that's the home of the original 1920 Scout motorcycle that Burt Munro had. You can't come to Invercargill and not see Burt Munro's Munro special Indian. Like Indian Scout motorcycle. You just can't do it. So It's like you can't come to Bluff and not have Bluff oysters. It's exactly the same thing. There's, there's like several things you've got to do here. But anyway, now we're gonna hit the road again and we're gonna be seeing you in Dunedin. We'll catch you there. Probably the funniest thing that I've ever seen in a translation. It's an aftershave. Black squared men, really. And today we're doing the Spates Brewery Tour here in Dunedin City. Spates, pride of the South. Let's get into it. Good on you, mate. The one whose, whose name is born on the company is James Spate. So the Stallman came from Yorkshire in the north of England in 1861. This guy is on a boat <laughs> with his family, headed toward the new land, which 
gives you a pretty good sense of his business sound. A series of silver medals. And here are some of the medals. Awesome. And then there are more downstairs. And we officially became the biggest brewery uh, in, in Dunedin in 1887 and one of the more prominent breweries in New Zealand. What, what cups does your dad have? Your dad has those cups. Yeah. Wow, so much history. Finds the grist from upstairs with the water from under the building. Basically spins everything around, heats it up to about 60 degrees Celsius, and turns it into a kind of sugar water. It's like a powdered, like making instant mashed potatoes, basically. Now, this kind of beats any wine tour we've ever done. The, this one here was the mash, so that's the lauder down here. Yeah. And this middle one here with the gauge, that's the kettle. Oh, it's actually, oh, it's got a light. And on we go. Oh, you really can't start smelling as soon as you start going down. What, is, what, do, you think that, what do you think it smells like? Oh my god. It's like toffee. It's like, um... It has a very distinct smell. And it's also very, very warm. Yeah, it is very warm. Yeah, so grab a seat. These beers are for you. You have earned them. Uh, you always get me feel drinking. I just like how <laughs> I reckon we've got to try the ultra low carb. But you've got to see what it's like. No, you can try it. Um, I did want to try the distinction, yes. Yeah. I'm excited that you have taken my advice. And it's totally okay if you don't care for it. I'm just excited. I'm just doing it for historical purposes. <laughs> it's research. <laughs> yeah, research, that's it. Okay, let's go for the old dark. And then she can do more of the hobby. Yeah, and then you can taste mine and share. Yeah. Yeah, we can share. Sharing is caring, honey. Yeah. This is the Spates Ultra Light, which is low in carbs, to be correct. You're right, it is light. It, like the name suggests. Oh, yeah. You see what you mean? Like yeah. it, it's like it's missing something. Yeah. It would probably be okay if I was driving. But somewhere. this is New Zealand's most popular beer at the moment. Yes. Wow. It is. It is the best selling beer in New Zealand. And you also don't have to drink all of it either. No, I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> 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 well, I know. Yeah. Now this is the distinction, which is as close as to the original <laughs> brew. Yeah. As, as we have. It's actually really nice. I'm not a big. Hey. It's that is really cool. Yeah. That's beer. Yeah. yeah. I feel yeah. like a real sullen man. <laughs> you know, like, I feel so like I should be out sharing my sheep or something. <laughs> I feel like yeah, a real sullen crazy. man too. <laughs> <laughs> Where is my? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Fresh on the beer. Awesome. And the third one we're trying is the Old Dark. I had to read that off. <laughs> I couldn't remember what I was trying. I swear I haven't had that too many. I haven't had too many beers. <laughs> Apparently this has a, a hint of chocolatey taste in there and it's an old, um, it's like a, it's a dark beer but not quite like a stout. So we're gonna try this. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like that. That is, yeah, it does have like a um, very chocolatey taste. So now we're onto the the other round, these are the hoppy ones. So this one is the Spates Triple Hop Pilsner. I'm, I actually like that. That was not smash in the face with hops. This one is the Idaho 7. I'm originally from Texas. Oh, okay. Um, but I've been here off and on. That's and cool. I really moved That's hoppy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but well, real really tropical notes on it. Unfortunately, due to this next part being continuously interrupted, we've had to pause it here and fast forward the rest of the beers so we don't actually get to show you the lot of them. We apologize for the inconvenience. So no one's here. This is our first bit of rain that we've come into on our whole honeymoon. Yay! <laughs> Yay! And we've come to Dunedin AA Ron Lodge. Uh, what number? 26? 26. Well, it's quite good. We're the only one, only camp, um, camper van here. We've got this whole campground to ourselves. 
can't. Pretty much. It, it is a Monday. Yeah, but people on holiday don't really have a. Um, pe retired people, like we've come across heaps of oh, grey nomads. Grey nomads is what you call them. Yeah. yeah grey nomads. We're just young digital nomads. Well, I'm young. Oh. No, you are a tad bit more. Let's go help her out. Yeah, sorry, it's raining, guys. <clears throat> Part of my duties, other than cameraman, is just reversing. Okay. Teeny bit wonky. You're a teeny bit wonky. You're a teeny bit wonky. Straighten up, yep, go straight back. Check that out. Juiced up, one here is the Distinction, and then one there's the Idaho 7 out of the, out of the three that we loved. After we finished the tour, everything that we bought in the gift shop was 20%. These were a Frickin' bargain. We can take them back into the Spates Brewery anytime and get them filled up for about five bucks. Yeah. I definitely. think that I think this big one over here was seven bucks to fill up. Yep. So we joined their mates club, which you, you can do anytime you're down in Dunedin. Do the tour because it was amazing. But you sign up and anytime you go through down there to do the brewery, you can get your riggers and your uh, any beers cheap as well as any of the merchandise. Which we got as well. I have a, it's a bit hard because I have a clip on, but I got my my very own hat. Just about tracky pants. Reusable yep. shopping bags. And support local, man. Support New Zealand. Exactly. The history of the Space Brewery was amazing. I, I'm a big history buff, so I love learning about how things have started and learning about James Spates. It was a really cool tour, and we just want to say thank you, Spates Brewery. Thanks, Allison. Thanks, Allison, thanks, our Jason. tour guide, and thanks, Jason, at the counter. You guys are amazing. Uh, 10 out of 10 for Dunedin at the moment. Bit Got more coming tomorrow. Yeah, that's right. So, if you thought this video was tight, leave us a like. This ain't no bribe. Please subscribe. And hey, what the hell? Ding that bell. And we'll catch you again in the next one. Bye. Welcome to Larnick Castle. It's quite windy at the top here. Big grandiose staircases. Whoa. And it just keeps going. This is the dungeon. Boy, do we have some cool things to show you today. Let's go.